Hi, this is Chad, and I'm going to show you how to fix the problem with the Java edition of the Minecraft server, where it will not start and keeps asking you to accept the end user license agreement over and over. Okay, so in the file system here, we see this file, server.jar, is the actual Minecraft server itself. And all these other files and folders around it are things that are extracted and created when it's successfully run for the uh, second time. The first time it's successfully run, it only extracts and creates uh, the end user license.txt file and the server.properties file. One is expected to go into this file and change the line that indicates EULA equals false to EULA equals true. At that point, you can then run the server and it will fully run and create all the rest of these files and folders. Um, let's take a look at the EULA that I have up here. And we can see here it says it's true. So what happened to me in the past was I successfully uh, played the Minecraft server and uh, some time went by and I forgot about it and then I tried to run it again and I kept getting this error. And it tells me I need to agree to the end user license agreement which I know I already have. As we can see, once again, it's set to true. So um, I finally was able to find, after surfing the internet for about a half an hour, someone who could explain what was going on, and it was tedious, and I had to look at a lot of uh, useless um, posts online before I found the one that uh, actually helped me fix the problem. And the cause and solution are really simple. When one starts Minecraft server, Java edition, it extracts these files and folders uh, in the working directory, not the directory where the server jar file is actually located. So when I was seeing this error here, it was because it was reading it from my working directory. Now my present working uh, directory is uh, my home folder, and if I look, to see, yes, there is an end user license agreement text file here and a server uh, dot properties file. And if we look at the contents of the uh, EULA here, we can see that it's set to false, and that's why it wasn't running. So the simple solution is to change directory into the um, folder where the server is and run it from there. So let's try that. So I hope this helps you avoid unnecessary internet surfing. And uh, if you have this problem, the solution is simple. Just change into the folder where the server.jar file is before you start the Minecraft Java edition server. Thanks a lot and have a good day.